It's four o'clock in the morning in Peoria, Illinois, and at the airport, something special is about to take place. Dozens of war veterans gathering to embark on a once in a lifetime journey. Yeah, I got it. The Greater Peoria Honor Flight is about to take off for Washington, D.C. The excitement just builds throughout the morning, and as you can see by all the smiles on the veterans' faces, they're excited for what the day is gonna bring them. I really want to go. I'm looking forward to it eagerly. Even if I had to get up early this morning, it's all right. Next stop, DC. The honor flight provides at no cost to the veterans the opportunity to see the memorials that the American people have built to honor them on our National Mall. World War II veterans get top priority for the program due to their advancing age. Historians say it was World War II that truly threatened our existence as a nation. It started one day with 12 veterans on four private planes coming to Washington. And the first year they had 1,200. And now we've flown 130,000 veterans to Washington, D.C. This is the greatest day that we could ever spend together, that honoring those who gave up and who fought for this country. Just one of these things, you know, before I die, I wanted to see it. Now I can go home and if I croak, so what? I did it. According to the Department of Veterans Affairs, our time to honor these brave men and women is running out. Really? Shook me up. That's why groups like the Greater Peoria Honor Flight and more than 130 hubs across America are working tirelessly to honor our heroes in a meaningful and wonderful way. Mark Oppold, RFD TV News.